Come take a road trip with us and learn about the history and culture of North Dakota. Double Ditch Indian Village offers a glimpse into our state's past. The site is the former home of the Mandan Indians who resided in this area along the Hart River for nearly 300 years until the tribe was nearly decimated by a smallpox epidemic in the 1780s. Today, the Earth Lodge Village is a state historic site with archaeological remains and interpretive signage explaining the culture and history of the area. The village is named for the visible trenches that surround it, once used as a means of fortification. Fort Abraham Lincoln is the oldest state park in North Dakota. Visitors can discover both Native American history and what life was like as a frontier soldier. The scenic park offers camping, hiking, horseback riding, and a variety of events. Lake Sakakawea is named for the woman more commonly known as Sakajawea, though the spelling and pronunciation of her name have been debated. North Dakota's official policy is to use the Sakakawea spelling. The 368,000 acre lake is one of the largest man-made reservoirs in the nation. The Lewis and Clark Interpretive Center is a museum whose official mission is to impart to the public a personal sense of President Thomas Jefferson's vision of expanding America to the West. It brings to life the daily experiences of the expedition. We also visited the Scandinavian Heritage Park. It is the only outdoor museum in the world that features all five Nordic nations. Denmark, Finland, Iceland, Norway, and Sweden. Rich in Scandinavian history and culture, the park includes a 240-year-old log house from Norway, a replica staber, a 27-foot-tall Swedish Dala horse, the Gullstav Church Museum, a Finnish sauna, Danish windmill, statues, a map plaza, picnic shelter, walking path, and gift shop. The picturesque park also hosts cultural events throughout the year. To learn more about the rest of our trip, check out onlyinyourstate.com.